Point Weather and Traffic together. Michelle joining us now, and I took Michelle's advice yesterday and took the kids down to the beach yesterday afternoon, Second Beach, and I was not alone. Mm -hmm. It was packed yesterday. What a day yesterday. Even at the beaches, we were up to close to 80 degrees, 83 for a second straight day at TF Green Airport. Today's still going to be a beautiful day, but not 80s, 60s for high temperatures. Oh, radar across Rhode Island and southeastern Mass. Dry skies again this morning. Uh, the weather headlines, a cooler but pleasant stretch here to finish out the work week and the school vacation week for the kids in Rhode Island. The second headline, we are looking at a dry finish to the week. And as we look at the third headline here, we do have some much needed rainfall on the way. It looks like especially by the second half of the weekend and early next week. You know, the uh, U.S. drought monitor that keeps an eye on conditions across the United States has southeastern New England under a severe drought right now. It does not take much wind. We have low humidity again today and very, very dry brush. So that is leading to that at least elevated fire risk today. The conditions aren't quite as severe as they were yesterday because the winds aren't going to be as strong, but you still need to use caution here until we get some of this relief here in the rain that I think looks to be on the way for early next week. 48 in Smithfield, 53 in Providence, 53 westerly, about 52 in Newport. So 40s and 50s for the commute into work this morning. The sunrise was at 6 o'clock. Your future cast at 8 a.m. here shows mainly sunny skies expected through the daytime today. This is 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And then later on this evening and tonight, there'll be a disturbance passing well to our south. Some of the clouds from that may work its way, may work their way at least into southern parts of our area before pushing to the south once again by tomorrow morning. So that leaves us Thursday with a mostly sunny day. In terms of the temperatures, well, we go from 83 to about 66 for the high today. The average is only 60 degrees, so we're still a warmer than normal stretch here for Central Falls, 65, North Providence, mid 60s, Rumford at 66, East Bay temperatures, mid 60s in Barrington. And as you head into Garden City and Tea of Green, also right around 66 degrees. Coast for today. Well, your temperatures will go from close to 80 to about 62 today for Charlestown, 65 Wickford, noticeably cooler but dry and mainly sunny, mid 60s in Coventry, northern suburbs, mid 60s as well, comfortable, dry and cooler, 66 for the high in Johnston, and a nice looking day in southeastern Massachusetts, mid 60s, mainly sunny, 63 Middletown, 63 in Little Compton, your seven day future cast. Well, the rain starts this weekend. I don't think Saturday is a washout. In fact, any rain that falls should be fairly light and scattered. More likely for Saturday night through probably Monday night. We could get some downpours off and on and on Sunday and again on Monday. Highs cooler near 60 degrees and there may still be some lingering showers.